this is Landon MK2, and uh, we're gonna be teaching you how to cook ramen noodles today. Anyways, we're just gonna teach you how to cook ramen noodles. If you don't know, then just grab your packet of ramen noodles and get this. Yeah. And get and get your pot. And if you have a bowl that can drain water out of it, then you'll have to use that. So, uh, you have to let the water boil. Two, cu two measuring cups. Sorry, guys. In that pot. It'll look. It has to be like on high. One high. Let turn on the light. See, it has to be on high. I just turned it, like, when it was off, I just do that. You so have that. to push it in. Yeah, you have to push it, then you can turn it. But if it's like that, you don't have to. So, uh, yeah. Let that boil, and if yeah. you s don't see the bottom, that means you turn it to four, and put your noodles in, and zip. And make sure not to put in the flavoring until the whole thing's done. Yeah. Excuse me. Yeah, but and you also need one of these. Yes. Yeah, if you don't, then uh, go to the store and find one and buy it. Unless you have something that, like, you have like a little Kool-Aid thing for Kool-Aid stuff, you can. Use that, you can have like the lid over it, and then you can um, have the lid on, and then you can dump all the water out while the rum rolls in. Yeah, because you surely do need the noodles. But just, we just want to keep the water in there and just keep it in. Yeah, but that'll be better. Yeah, I yeah, bet you guys can't even see the smoke. Oh, you guys can't fan. What's going on over here? I don't know. But look, we only have chicken flavor. I'll show you the plants that we had. We had beef flavor. See, look. Beef flavor. But we don't have any more. See, watch. You see. Empty box. Oh, yeah, just leave it in. Just leave it in there. Yeah, but that's. Oh, yeah, but you guys can see it boiling up some more. Stop. But here, you go back to the farm. Okay. So, uh, yeah, just watch Toby, okay? Yeah, yeah, I don't have that phone straight up over the top, because then uh, the phone would just drop in. Unless you're holding it really tight. Yeah, but don't, because you know, no, it could accidentally fall in. I'm pretty sure you guys can, definitely. That's all the yeah. steam coming out. Yeah, it's right there. I'm not sure yeah. if you guys can see it. Yeah, it's but right. just comment me down below if you could see the steam, okay? So, uh, yeah. But if you know how to cook ramen noodles, you don't have to watch it, but you can if you want to. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I can't even see the bomb. But if you already know how to cook ramen noodles, and if you're watching this video, you can just comment um, in the comment section and say you already know how to cook ramen noodles. And, um... Okay, I recommend you put it to four and put your noodles in right now. Okay. Hey. If you see it boiling, boiling a lot, that means you turn it to four and you put your noodles in. You guys see it at number four? 
Yeah, that's probably a different can. So, uh, yeah. Fact number four is look at this. You open it. Yeah, you first, you open this. So, uh, yeah. Put that in. And then just, this perfect size. literally just keep on stabbing it. But my brother says just stir it. So I prefer you just stab it, okay? No, I it, first prefer you guys just um, spin it. So, uh, yeah. Since those other steps teach you how to do those, we're going to teach you how to do this. Yeah, I'm scared. Work, and when it's starting to split apart, then like a whole lot, then you just dump it like, in look, your bowl. I got this. You just dump it in that, and let the water drain, and then you'll be fine. But then let the water out for like 30 seconds or so. Whatever, 30 seconds. Yeah, can you guys see it soggy? You don't want it soggy. Like, like a little wet, or a lot wet. You don't want it, like, wet. Alright, as you guys see, you see it's off, right? Yeah. There you are, now, focus on the, the pot. You take it, and you dump it in there, and let the water drain, and then you take your bowl take your bowl and then dump it uh, yeah dump, you dump it, it and then dump the flavoring in yeah but and first keep on stirring but it. if you see it like this you should just mix it up some so it's not like that and it's all this like no, like, looks like a wig. So, uh, yeah, dump it in. Dump yeah. the flavoring in and then stir it. Unless it looks like a wig. Like, no, no. Or something. It doesn't have to look Or if like it that. looks like a wig, you can just split it apart. Just, no, no stop. Just, just and then one. you're going to just, hmm. just dump Add. it in, the, the flavoring in, and then stir it for two the minutes. Center. Uh, yeah, yeah. You had to keep the yeah. Um, then once you dump it in, mix it up for two minutes, and it would look great, great like real ramen noodles. How your parents would cook it. But if you guys don't have parents out there, you own a house or have a house, and you're watching this, I feel bad for you. But this is how you would make ramen noodles, and you can make tons of food. We've been making more kind of food, but we don't have that much kind of food. We have macaroni and cheese, this ramen noodle we had. You might probably get some more beef flavor. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a minute, Hold and, uh, on. I'll, yeah. Hold on. And, and if you guys see us have the beef one, you just have it. Like, if you guys have beef one, you just follow all the instructions, like this one. Every because, other ramen noodle flavors. Yeah, yeah, all the ramen noodles have the same instruction. Like, they all have different flavoring, but they all have the same instructions. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a minute, and I'll show you guys the finished re results. So, uh, this is our finished results. So, uh, Toby. Go ahead and eat it and tell us how it tastes. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna take that bit. It tastes really great. Okay, so uh, thanks for watching this, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah, this uh, is my dinner. Bye. Thanks.